In summary, my essay is about the regions in the genome that regulate the protein so that um, allow the proteins to be switched on and switched off at the right moment in time uh, during development, for example. And what we found out is that there's actually a great um, diversity in how these uh, regulatory elements change during evolutionary times. And um, we also found out that elements that were thought to be um, more parasitic elements in the genome and called junk DNA actually can also give rise and innovation to gene regulation. And this obviously has direct implications for any model organism that is used in research and how potentially in, in human diseases that also underlie evolutionary processes such as cancer might be affected by changes in gene regulation. I became interested in understanding uh, the regulation of the genome because when I started my studies, the human genome sequence had just been published the year before and it became evident very fast that we could find the genes in the genome but we couldn't immediately understand um, how these genes are regulated. But it was very obvious that since many regulatory genes are frequently uh, mutated in many human diseases, that it would be very important to understand this part of the puzzle. And I was fascinated by the idea to, to help understand how genes are regulated and how this has changed in human diseases. I enjoyed most about my research um, the fact that you're given the opportunity after a lot of hard work to be able to find out new things and being the, the first human being that sees a new result that might potentially be a paradigm shift in a particular field. And I think that was really the most exciting thing that got me out of bed um, every morning, going to the lab, working on weekends. I would advise anybody uh, who sees this really to apply. Um, the more people apply, the more the prize will mean in the future and the more it will help uh, science and young scientists to develop their careers. To be completely honest, I, I have no idea where the future will lead me in the next five to ten years. Um, but I'm very optimistic about the future. I always went for what I enjoyed the most and that is also the advice that I would give to anybody. Um, follow your passion and do what you enjoy most and all the rest will sort itself out.